Hey guys, um, so back with another video here. Um, my newest game I'm just about to complete is Jack and Daxter, the first one out of the trilogy I have. Um, so let's get this platinum. The last platinum, or the last trophy I need for the platinum is the last power orb. So I have 100, the last one I got, or last one I'm getting. I kind of finished it already. Like here, this is the one, raise the chamber. And uh, what I did was I kind of started, started it until I got it. Let me turn this down a bit. Whoa. So what you have to do is grab some blue eco, jump up and just get close to these guys here. There's five of them that you have to get to. So there's one there, there's one down there, there's one right there, and there's just two more. After you get the blue eco that's laying around, <clears throat> after you get that, yeah, there's the blue eco there. You gotta get into, where the hell's the hole? Go into this hole here. Yeah, so a little bit of a review on this game. I did enjoy it. Um, I had a couple, little bit of troubles with it. It's the controls are not as good as the PlayStation Two or Three, for that matter, because um, it's just like the camera doesn't move where you want it to. Sometimes uh, it's fuck when you're backtracking. It's just horrible. Jumping like when you want to backtrack to get like a or you miss something and you only just realize like um the power cell or some of the orbs it's just a bitch because um there's a couple bike missions where you gotta fly on this weird thing go through but when you're coming back uh the camera won't turn around so you can't see what's in front of you you have to be fate like your your character is facing the camera like this so you can't actually see where you're going. Sometimes I fall into the lava pit. But this is a fun game overall. Really fun. I've never played it until I got this Vita. Um, I never had a... Well, I had a PlayStation 2 when it first came out. But the only game I had was... Uh, Grand Theft... Not Grand Theft Auto. What is that? What is that racing game? Grand Turismo 3. And that was like a bundle that came out. And uh, there it is. That was the bundle that came out, and um, I never had a memory card, so in the end, I never really played it after that, because pff, I couldn't save my games. I didn't know that you could buy memory cards. It was only like fucking eight when it came out, so I wasn't the one with the money. So this is just sinking now. <clears throat> it's really cool, though, having to, find the, having to find all this stuff, and the story that's in there is pretty cool, too. It's kind of funny. Actually, it's really funny when you really just get to know the characters and how they act. Daxter, in the end, he really uh, made me laugh, too. It was kind of a bitch ending for him because he had to, um, well, defeat the guy that could turn him back. Or we had to use the uh, Dark Eco, I think, and that was the only thing that can turn him back into a human. And uh, we had to use it to destroy the guy and, or... Uh, put him in a cage or whatever the fuck it was but yeah that's this is my uh let's see what platinum number this is this is number one two three four this is my fifth one um i don't know if i'm gonna start the second one because i i, I did enjoy the game but i didn't really enjoy it enough to really start up the next game so i might be getting rid of it i'm not too sure i really want to get um, Uncharted Golden Abyss. I know it's free on Plus, but my internet is just so bad. I can't download the three gigs. Um, it takes me like a day because I'm on a little dongle thing, a three network, like a hotspot thing. And it's just ass. So <clears throat> I'm just going to try and buy it. I like finding like treasures and hidden stuff. Like uh, for Killzone, it was Intel and all that kind of thing. But uh, overall, for a PlayStation exclusive game, I had so much fun with it. Um, 
I finished it quite quick after Killzone Mercenary because I had it uh, I had it done already halfway, and then this came out and I had to beat that right away. But yeah, good game. And uh, if you guys have any suggestions actually for a game on the PS Vita, let me know and I'll give it a whirl and try and get that a hundred percent. That's what I'm. <clears throat> that's what my goals are for these games. So yeah, but this one, this one is done a hundred percent. It's just the uh, the add on. I just don't want to waste money on it because this one was free off the PSN, and I don't want to pay the two pounds to uh, get it because I accidentally made a British account. But, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.